What makes me me is Supergirl. Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on the Supergirl film. So today we've got a little bit of an update, a little bit of a rumor that we're going to be breaking down. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV or DC film videos. So today we're going to be going over some new potential news as in regards to the new Supergirl film that was announced a few weeks ago. I did a video on that. And so we're going to be going over a new report according to Geeks Worldwide and they've reported that Reed Moreno is currently at the top of the wish list for directors to possibly helm Supergirl. So right now this is only a wish list as the reports actually say and they've not actually reached out to Moreno as of right now as to officially direct the film but this is right at the top of their list and I'm really excited. So the Supergirl film is something that I'm really really anticipating and Reed Moreno if you don't know is actually a very well respected film director and cinematographer. She originally was a cinematographer. She's known for some beautiful cinematography that she's done in the past in films such as Frozen River and Kill Your Darlings. And then she actually went on to direct her film feature debut, which was Meadowland, a beautiful film and you can really see that she has an eye for picture and obviously for storytelling as well and so she is a great director and she's got this new film coming up that I'm actually really really looking forward to and it's called I Think We're Alone Now and some of the trailers have actually been released for that and it looks great and this is why I'm really excited for the Supergirl film potentially having Reed Moreno as the director because it could truly bring something to DC films that really has hasn't been done that well before like she is an amazing cinematographer so she has the eye for picture I think this film will be beautiful if they end up going for Reed Moreno and that is something that I really adored about Wonder Woman it looked amazing as you know Zack Snyder not the best of directors but he does have an eye for cinematography does have an eye for picture but Reed Moreno is like on another level she is an amazing cinematographer and I think that's the crucial factor of why I'm so excited is because she is a cinematographer that has gone on to direct so it's all about the picture and she has proven herself as a great director as well and she actually directed a few episodes of The Hands Made Tell she actually won an Emmy for one of those episodes for directing on a TV show. So this all really excites me and now I just quickly want to go on to the Supergirl TV side of it all because I'm still getting loads of questions as in regards to this film as to why Melissa Benoist won't be in the film. As I explained in my other video, I'm just going to quickly go over it again and this is more to do with the reason why she couldn't in fact do this film. So the reason is Melissa shoots nearly 8 months to 9 months round the whole year shooting the Supergirl TV show and if there was a gap where they could film obviously they would try to go for Melissa because she is really well respected as Supergirl everyone knows her as Supergirl now and the reason why they will cast someone else due to that TV show schedule being so long taking up so much of the year and to put a film into production with a person that's not going to be around barely any of the time maybe she'll have like a few weeks off during the hiatus every now and again it just doesn't work out and it's the scheduling of it all as to why Melissa wouldn't actually end up being in this film so they would definitely cast a new Supergirl in my opinion and I'm not mad about that because we've still got the TV show same thing goes for The Flash when they cast Ezra Miller I'm not the biggest fan of his Flash but I was still happy that we had the TV show version and you can look towards that you know I think TV right now is being regarded in a much greater way than it has in the past and so I feel like if this film was under Reed Moreno I think we're in great hands and this would turn out to be an amazing film and this really excites me because she's a great director great cinematographer and like what DC is trying to do right now they're trying to get more of those sort of auteur like directors obviously 
They've got Steven Spielberg, which is just insane. They've got some of the new directors like David Sandberg directing Shazam and a few other ones that they're all lining up to do. So I'm really excited. Let me know in the comments below. Have you seen any of Reed Moreno's films? Do you really like the pictures and the way she actually directs? And are you guys excited for the Supergirl film, even if it's without Melissa? So anyway, guys, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Shut free.